And once again, it's time for Safer with Schaefer. This is John Schaefer right here. And John, I think today we're going to call it maybe be a saver with Schaefer because, all right, we're going to talk about insurance rates. Insurance rates. Uh, uh, we're seeing them go up. What, yeah, what's going they're on? They're going to skyrocket this year. It's just the due, you know, with all the recent claims that last year was like the worst year we've had in the last 10 years uh -huh. of hail, wind claims. We had straight line winds. All that good stuff. Insurance companies pay out. Like I said before, it's like a checking account. Sure. So we had a lot of natural disasters last year that really affected the Midwest. Uh, the climate change, you know, I think we had more freezing temperatures there early in the spring. Mm -hmm. And now, let, well, let me yeah. ask you that yeah. first. Natural disasters. Mm -hmm. Insurance isn't just based on Missouri, if you lived in Missouri, or right. Arkansas. Right. If things happen in California or Florida or whatever, that will affect our rates as well. That's right, yeah. It all okay. affects because it's just, for example, like one of the companies you represent, you know, they just don't cover Missouri only, they cover other, other states. Okay. So right. um, we had a lot of high winds, like to talk about, oh, icier yeah. conditions, uh, higher cost of repairs. This is still the aftermath of COVID, you know, Labor's more, materials cost more. Shipping, yep. everything. Roofing We've got materials. The whole supply chain. Right. Uh -huh. Another thing, too, we've seen this year is surcharge in pets. So if you've got certain breeds of dogs, a lot of insurance companies aren't doing those now. I found out the other day that um, a Great Dane is actually the breed off of a Mastiff. And uh -huh. so, like, one company I got would not do it because. They were like, well, that Great Dane came from a Mastiff breed down the line. And that's going to more da do more damage Do more damage. Well, that, you know, bites. So, and any, ah. so bite history. So, really looking at uh, certain breeds of dogs. If you're going to get a dog, you may want to check with your insurance company and make sure that that dog is going to be covered on your insurance because it's a high liability for insurance companies. All right. And so, liability payouts high. Yeah, payout liabilities, especially this last year. And that's to do with, you know, if you've got somebody at your house that falls, your mm -hmm. homeowner's insurance pays for that, and it's not cheap. So mm -hmm. um, is it temporary? Uh, it may be just this year. It may get better next year, we hope. Yeah. But we've seen a lot of companies last year, at the end of the year, leave the state. A lot of insurance companies paid out too much money, and some people have seen it. A lot of insurance companies said, hey, we're not going to do Missouri anymore, and told people to find other insurance companies. So they just pick up just and left, leave. Just left the disappear. state, yep. Ah. So... Um, also, wind and hail deductibles. We've actually seen a lot of companies and heard of other companies beside ours doing a higher deductible this year on wind and hail because there's so many claims in the Midwest. Okay. So we're seeing companies do a 1% deductible on your cover J, you know, minimum doing a $2,500 deductible wind and hail. Mm -hmm. um, so it's really good if you don't have me as your insurance agent, maybe really check with your agent and see what your wind and hail deductible is. All right. Okay. Yep. Um, so ways to save. This is what I'm saying. Say, say, be a saver with Schaefer. That's right. Okay. Here are the points that you want to get. You know, people, they can keep a little more of the That's dollars right. in their own pocket. That's right. So give me a call. I can shop your insurance, get you the best rate. Uh, we put a void file on a claim. If you've got a small claim, you know, that's not really it's maybe $1,000 or below your deductible, you don't want to file that because you're below your deductible. Right. So, so you're filing a claim you're going to be paying on right, it anyway. Right, right. All right. Um, check to make sure you're covered for hell damage which mostly all homeowners insurance policies are covered, uh -huh. but make sure you know your deductible. I've seen some people have a $1,500 deductible, but on wind and hail, they have a 1%. If you have a $500,000 house coverage, that's $5,000. Okay. So, right. And work with an agent who will customize your policy, like which myself. Which is what you do. That's right. Because you do all the other things, shopping it around and find out you don't make it one for everyone. That's right. There's so. a QR code, of course. You can call John, 766 Four six eight nine, and you can find them at the resource center. That's right. right. Be glad to help you, John. I have you too.